Top 7 BST GPU for VR in 2022 Through extensive research and testing, I have put together the list of options that will meet the need of different types of buyers. For more information, I have put links of products in the description. Make sure to check it out. Like the video, comment, don't forget to subscribe, and let's get started. Number 7. Gigabyte GeForce RTX 2080 Ti Gaming OC Moving on, we have another graphics card by Gigabyte. The RTX 2080 Ti Gaming OC, featuring the TU-102 GPU and custom-built PCB and Gigabyte successful Wind Force cooler. Not the best, but it is still respect-worthy. The results from the benchmark showed truly that how capable the RTX 2080 Ti is. 1,008 type, 1,404 type, and 4K, respectively. We are looking at impressive results. However, the AMD Radeon RX 6700 XD, RTX 3070, and above, managed to gain a lead over the former fastest GPU. The GPU is overkill for 1080 type unless it is paired with a high refresh rate monitor. It is excellent for 1404 type and 4K gaming. And since VR is anything but 1404 type and 4K gaming for most headsets, the card is more than loaded for virtual reality. The acoustics and cooling performance of this GPU is already impressive, and if you manage to get your hands on this, do not think twice about whether you should purchase it or not. Get it before others do. Number 6. XFX AMD Radeon R X580 GTS XXX XFX is an American manufacturer of PSU motherboards and graphics cards, which sound more Chinese than American, to me at least. It is one of the few names that many people might have never heard before which makes sense, as it is not long since the company started manufacturing GPU. XFX used to manufacture NVIDIA GPU, but eventually started manufacturing AMD GPU. With a brief introduction, we have the RX 580 GTS XXX Edition graphics card. Before that, you might be wondering why RX 580. Isn't it too slow for VR? The reason you are finding an RX 580 is because of the awful GPU shortage and surreal prices. It is harder to get hands on decent GPU. If you are planning for a decent VR experience and want a graphics card for your rig urgently, the RX 580 GTS XXX is a sufficient GPU that will fulfill your VR requirements just fine. It has the most average looks for a graphics card, but we are more interested in VR and performance than anything else. One of the best things about this beast is the 8GB VRAM that is rare for a card targeted for 1000 ADI performance. Number 5. Zonic Gaming GeForce RTX 3070 Ti AMP Holo Next, we have the RTX 3070 Ti AMP Holo by Zonic, the company's fastest version of the RTX 3070 Ti. The RTX 3070 Ti AMP Holo features NVIDIA's GA104 GPU cooled by Zodak's custom-built triple fan cooler. It is packed with features and support technologies like DLSS and ray tracing. In gaming, the card is a beast at 1008 type and 1404 type, which is more than capable of 4K gaming at 60 FPS. However, the card is marketed for 1404 type, so up to that resolution, you will be more than delighted with the performance of this GPU. VR-wise, it is VR-ready, and all you need is to buy the card, plug it in your system, connect the VR headset, launch your desired game, and you will be good to go. The hardest part in the above sequence is getting the graphics card at an acceptable price tag. Number 4. Gigabyte GeForce RTX 3060 Ti Gaming OC If you are looking for a budget-friendly, excellent Valve GPU for 1008 type or 1404 type gaming that can handle VR gaming just as fine, Look no further as we have the Gigabyte GeForce RTX 3060 Ti Gaming OC. Featuring a familiar Gigabyte design, but is still attractive. It features a triple fan design wind force cooler, RGB lit logo, and a custom built PCB designed for nothing but sheer performance. Performance wise, it can replace the RTX 2080. Yep, you read that right, the RTX 2080. It shares the same GA104 GPU underneath the attractive front plate with a boost clock speed of 1770 MHz, which is 6% faster than the reference 3060 Ti. In games like Metro Exodus, we are looking at 3% more performance than the 2080 and almost 41% performance uplift 
compared to the RTX 2060 at 1000 a type, and the same trend was observed at 1400 4 type and 4K. The RTX 3060 Ti Gaming OC is rated for a whopping 250 watts of power consumption, over 56% increase than the RTX 2060 and 108% more than the GTX 1660 Ti. Overall, it is a well-rounded graphics card with mind-blowing value. If you manage to find one at MSRP, you might be wondering what about the VR performance? The VR performance of this GPU can be summarized in two words, it performs. Number 3. Zonic Gaming G Force RTX 3080 Ti AMP Holo The RTX 3080 Ti is a beast that goes toe-to-toe -to -toe against NVIDIA's King of the Hill or TX 3090 while being cheaper. It is one of the pretty-looking versions of the 3080 Ti in the market. It does come with a faster boost clock speed out of the box. But a mere 45 MHz increase is not something to get excited over. The card comes at a premium price, and you may find it costing more than an RTX 3090, which does not make any sense whatsoever. It is one of the best-performing GPU and benchmarks. Naturally, at 1000 ADIPE and 1404 ADIPE, the GPU breaks no sweat and delivers over 90 FPS in demanding games, peaking up to 150 FPS in less demanding titles like Call of Duty, Warzone, and Days Gone. We are more interested in the VR performance of this graphics card, and it performs probably as per expectations. In Half-Life, Alex, it delivered over 90 FPS in maxed out setting, and if it handles Alex this good, you can imagine the rest. But what about cooling performance? Well. The temperatures are pretty decent. We are looking at 70 degrees maximum temps in Metro Exodus 1404 I maxed out graphics. Under for Mark's stress test, the GPU peaked at 69 degrees, depicting its mighty cooling prowess. Number 2. Power Color Red Devil AMD Radeon RX 6900 XD I would not be surprised if you might never heard about Power Color graphics cards before. Power Color manufactures AMD Radeon graphics cards only, ranging from affordable cards to high-end gaming g -Pus. The Red Devil RX 6900 XD is a high-end graphics card ready to take you on a journey of the rapture of joy in VR. It might not be the prettiest in terms of looks and aesthetics in the market, and has probably one of the bulkiest heat sinks. This bulkiness might be a turn-off and have trouble fitting in most cases, and not to forget GPU sag if it does not have bracket support. This Navi 21 GPU is a gaming beast capable of giving NVIDIA's magnum opus, I, the RTX 3090, a tough time while offering mind-blowing cost per frame and performance per watt ratios. The card is already excellent for 4K gaming, and since the standard resolution of most of the VR headsets is 1000 a type, prepare for an out-of-the-world VR experience. Number 1. MSI NVIDIA GeForce RTX 3060 Tie Gaming X First, we have the MSI RTX 3060 Ti Gaming X. I can rant all day about GPU shortage and how new variants of the RTX 30 series GPUS keep dropping. But I do not want to turn the article itself into a lament of the current market situation of the graphics cards. The RTX 3060 Ti is a beast, and trade blows with the RTX 2080 Ti though it is still slower but destroys 2080 by a convincing margin and barely falls short to the RX 6700 XD. The Gaming X features 8GB GDDR6 memory, a 12% increase in CUDA cores, and MC's Trifrozer 8 technology for outstanding cooling performance. MSI looks really proud of its Frozer technology, and when put under stress, it does an exceptional job of keeping the GPU under the 65 degrees Celsius mark. Decent cooling performance out of the Gaming X. It comes out with a fast boost clock speed out of the box with a whopping 1770 MHz, 6% faster than the NVIDIA boost clock speeds. MSI recommends using a 600 watts power supply. VR-wise, the MSI RTX 3060 Ti Gaming X is more than ready, and when paired with a decent VR headset, it delivers the best possible virtual reality experience. So guys, that's all for the top 7 BST GPU for VR in 2022. The links of all products are given in the description, which are updated for the best prices. Subscribe our channel for more videos. We will meet in next video till then take care bye.